Hey everybody, I'm working here in the shop today and working on uh, putting an armrest on my 1000 Pioneer Honda Pioneer side by side. So, anyway, I enjoy when the door's on, I enjoy having the armrest. It's uh, really nice. Uh, Gives you a lot of support. Something to lean against when you're sidling on the side of a hill. So I really, uh, really miss that when I take my door off. And I do take my door off in the summertime. So it just lifts right up off the hinges here. I don't know if you can see them or not. But it's got two hinges right here. And it just lifts right up. And you take it off. So then you... Uh, you lose your armrest, of course. So uh, that's what I'm doing here today. I'm fabricating an armrest to put on the side by side for in the summertime when I take my door off. I'll show you what I got here. I'm new at this, you guys, so uh, don't be too hard on me. Let me get, I don't know, get this over here where you can see. Hopefully you'll be able to see there. Maybe not. Anyway, I'll show you what I've made up here. It's a combination of wood and steel. And I took some, uh, I took some scrap steel that I had laying around the shop here. It just happens to be a little, little piece of tubing, kind of a thin gauge, thin gauge tubing. It's not real thick, but yet it's strong. So I cut me a piece of that off and uh, I took and uh, rolled this over. I'll, I'll, I'll go in there and show you how it mounts up. But anyway, I took and rolled this over so that it would swing up and down. And I'm mount, mount, mounting it to the side of the, of the body over there that stays on when the door comes off. Door post, I guess I should say. So anyway, then, I'll show you how this mounts up, but um, on the end here, then I welded a, uh, welded a little piece of plate in there and uh, so that it wouldn't have sharp edges because it does look like this. And I will take you over there and show you how this thing mounts up. you can see I hope that you can so anyway now I'm gonna be running I drilled a quarter inch hole through here and uh, I'm gonna be drawing this up the uh, the hole gets drilled right through your door post over here this is just a quarter inch bolt right here but uh, but you do that, you, you make that up so that it's the same height as your door here. Then when the door comes off, your armrest comes down, then it's at the right height. So that's how you can tell how high or low you want to be on that. And then you do have a little flange sticking out right here. So, so to uh, compensate for that, I just picked up a three-quarter nut here. And, uh, and then one, one thin washer. And I'll stick that on there first. And that right there then makes this parallel with this little flange right here. Everything's flat then. So then, to keep this, like I say, you're going to be drawing that up. So to keep that from uh, mashing shut, I, I picked up another nut, which is just the right thickness to go in there. Or should be. Yeah, and he goes in there, but it needs to go kind of tight because if it goes real loose, it's just going to roll right back in the tubing. So then you just take, 
it's pretty simple to put on. Just take and uh, get that started over your bolt. Then I'll get my nut and my washer right here. I'll put a nut and a washer on there. Now I don't have this thing painted up yet. I'm getting ready, I was getting ready to paint it, but I thought I would show it to you before I painted it. So you get that nut started on there. Just takes a 7 16 so then I'm going to use my, get this raised up here on my shoulder so everything gives me room. I'll stick my gun on the outside. Draw that up there kind of snug. You see how everything levels up right now? I got the spacing back there of the nut and the washer that that uh, spaces it up and uh, so it, it doesn't it, if, if you if you mount this at this height it doesn't uh, interfere with you getting in and out of it you still got lots of room to get in and out of it so just let me get in here and, and we'll put it down you just reach up here and pull it down and you got a nice armrest and you got, and the reason for this board right here is you can put, you can lean on it. It gives you something to lean on. I don't know if you can see it or not. Sorry about that. But, but this board right here, the reason for that, that piece right there just bolted onto your piece of metal right there. You just bolt that on. And, um, and then that gives you something to, to put your, put your shoulder up against and that way when you're going around a, a slope or or whatever and you're leaning where you would normally lean on the door but of course the door's gone you you get you, you've taken the door off but uh, but this gives you something then to lean on and you're not leaning on a sharp edge right here so so anyway then you lean you know I just and this is this is the same height as the door, so it uh, it's actually very comfortable, very comfortable. I actually love it. And then uh, I don't know if you can see. I guess you can, but uh, like I say, I put that piece of metal in there so there's no sharp edges, and you stick your fingers down over there. But everything's nice and smooth. It's uh, I used uh, I used oak. I I like using oak a lot. Uh, hardwood rather than pine and then I did countersink my screws when I put my screws in it but uh, yeah I love it so then you just shove it up it now what makes it stay up is the tension that you put on this bolt right here if you uh, if you draw that up then it rubs hard enough it goes up and down hard enough that it stays put wherever you want it there, wherever. And here you can get a better picture of that board now that I'm out of the way that you lean against. So this is pretty important. And um, dang on, I don't think you can see. But, but when this comes down, when this comes down, what keeps it from going on down is this board actually butts up against this post, this door post right here. So that's what stops it from going down. So, actually works very nice. Very nice. All it needs is some paint now. But, um, but like I say, it doesn't interfere with you getting in and out. Which is very important. You don't want something that's going to interfere with you getting in and out. And you're ready to go. I love it. So there you go, folks. I hope that um, I hope that's interesting to you guys. Something you might be interested in doing doesn't take a whole lot, but uh, I get some paint on it. It'll uh, it'll look, should look pretty nice. So.
So thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. And uh, so I'm new to this. If you uh, if you if you like the video, I appreciate it if you'd hit like and subscribe. So thanks a lot. Till next time.